Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the 2018 Anakin's Jedi Starfighter. Starting off with the box, we have the Last Jedi packaging, I believe. I hated that packaging. Um, it is ages 7 through 12, set 75214 Anakin's Jedi Starfighter with 247 pieces and too many figures. It retailed for $20. Uh, before we begin with the ship though, let's go ahead and get into the minifigures. Starting out with our very standard R2-D2. Looks good. The dome print is very, very even. They used to have an issue with that, and I feel like that's not something that happens anymore. This one's really straight. No back printing because it was 2018, but that's R2-D2. And then we get this Clone Wars Anakin, and he is pretty cool. He's got a brand new torso. I think also, uh, those legs are probably reused, but the torso is new for this year. And um, it has printing on the back, which is really cool. This is reminiscent of the 2008 uh, Clone Wars clone Jedi armor that um, I guess maybe general armor that Anakin wore which is really cool and then he has a new head for this year with the headset and angry it's really nice you can see his let's see if we get a close-up you see kind of I guess those are lines and not really his scar yet uh, but it looks really cool it's nice to see an updated 2008 Clone Wars armor um, outfit because we literally haven't gotten one in so long. Um, really neat. Here we are and I am reviewing this in 2024 now because I never picked up this ship. Never picked up any of the Anakin's Starfighters. Um, I have always preferred the Jedi Interceptors more. I just like the way they look a little bit more but the Starfighters are like classic as well. So I'm really glad that I finally got this because it is definitely one that I regretted not getting. I saw it on the shelves forever and at $20 thinking back I just did like golly. I don't know. I don't know where my head 2018 was a super broke year for me. I was living in an apartment and also going to school and really heavy into action figures. And so Lego was definitely on the back burner at the time. That's probably why I skipped it, but I do have some other Jedi Starfighters. And so I am excited to add this one in. So as you can tell, here it is. We have the classic uh, gray and yellow look here with some stud shooters on the front that kind of interrupt that. There are a couple of stickers on the front to help give it some detail, as well as the Republic symbol in a sticker on the side, um, as well as the back fins. And then this final fin also is stickered. We have some yellow engines, which I think look pretty good. And overall, I think that it looks nice. It's not too high. I think that the, the, um, the slope of the Starfighter looks correct. Has a little bit of landing gear here at the bottom with just a singular foot that pops out but it does the job so we don't need anything else it is a little wobbly you could tip it over if you wanted to um but other than that it's great we have r2d2 that fits in the cockpit in the center you have to just turn his head to the side like is pretty common these days and then anakin skywalker fits in the pilot cockpit looking nice there is a little stickered no little printed screen there um, and he is stuck on all four studs. So you end up sometimes losing his legs to the ship. I hate that. I think that that's something that they don't do much, hardly at all these days because they have learned from the error of their ways. Um, I'm very glad for that. There is a little bit of gappage on the inside. Obviously it's not gonna be secure from space, which is a bummer. Um, I would have liked to see that flushed out just a little bit more because we do see it flushed out more in other sets, but it is possible they just sacrificed this space so they could get it a little bit more symmetrical. Um, the wings do not move. I know sometimes we've had that happen with previous Jedi Starfighters, so it is good to see they have corrected the issue and it looks pretty dang good. I think overall, it's a great set. 2018, we're about due for an update, I would say, if they follow their trend. However, I would like to see something other than an Obi-Wan or an Anakin Starfighter. I say update, but we just had an Obi-Wan Jedi Starfighter, so we won't be getting another one of these for quite some time, I'm sure. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the review. Let me know what you think below, and until um, next time, guys, I'll catch you later.